bid you welcome. The theater is a temple, and we are here to honor the gods of comedy and tragedy. Tonight, I am pleased to announce a... Comedy. A comedy! Thank you. Uh, we will use every device we know in our efforts to uh, divert you. Probably my favorite character in the piece. 
a role of such enormous variety and nuance, played by an actor of such, well, ourselves in your hands. The play begins. Slaves! We are about to embark on our journey. My robe? Wife. Slaves, stop crunching and fetching. 
and I answered, ever your humble. Have you prepared my potions? Ah, uh, yes, madam. In addition to your usual potions, I have prepared one for queasiness and one for tantrums. Oh, thank you, Miss Darian, slave of slaves. I live to grovel. Oh. Mm -hmm. Hero, come kiss your mother goodbye. Yes, mother. Take that baggage and go before us, you clumsy. Yes, 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 yes clumsy, 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 you're right there. Yes, ma'am. I was just saying shame, shame, <laughs> shame. Sarah. Yes, madam. Where is Sutilus? Where is he indeed? I have not seen him since he dressed Hero this morning. Well, tell him that while we are gone, he is to take care of Hero. He is to keep him cheerful, well fed, and far from the opposite sex. My dear, the boy has to learn sometime. And when that time comes, you shall tell him. Yes, dear. What little you know. <laughs> now go and fetch the gift. Yes, dear. Uh, good morning, Father. Sure. <laughs> oh, hero. We are off to the country to visit my mother. What a joy it would be were you to accompany us. But at last, the sight of anyone in good health fills my mother with rage. Ah! There I am! <laughs> Do you think it will please my mother? Ah, yes, madam. Uh, the craftsmanship is superb. Uh, and the resemblance? <laughs> Frightening. <laughs> the time of farewell is at hand. Hysteria, here are my husband's final instructions. While we are gone, his entire household is in your spotless care. Your word shall be absolute, your authority unquestioned. And furthermore, we are on our way. We're on our way. Farewell, beloved son. Farewell, thoughtful hysteria. Saints, come along and carry my box. Yes, dear! Never fall in love during a total eclipse. To work, to work. Now that I am completely in charge, I am going to be a very busy slave. Yeah! Here! Come away from there. You must never know what goes on inside that house. But I do know. You do? Amazing, isn't it? Well, I can't stand around here chatting. Sudalis! I've 
was not parading. This is parading. <laughs> <coughs> I was walking. Oh no, you don't. It was a demonstration, guys, relax. He invited us to game with him, and in a matter of moments, he had taken our money. He was using weighted ducks. <laughs> Give them the money. He took nine minutes. Nine? I took seven. Give them nine. I took seven. <laughs> Fuck you. One, two. I'm being cheated out of money. I won fairly. Seven, eight. Hey, what happened to five and six? I'm coming to them. Nine, five, six. I should be whipped. Gently. <laughs> but you should know. I only did it for the money. I thought if I could raise enough, you'd let me buy my freedom from you. Oh, Sudalis, not again. It's all I think about. I hate being a slave. Better a slave than a slave to love. Yeah, sure. That's easy for you to say. Love? You? <laughs> Tell me, master, who is she? Anyone I know? Oh, well, sometimes. You can see her through that window. Through that window? Oh, my God! <laughs> House, uh, the, uh, a courtesan of the house of Marcus Lycus? Do you know how many men I a girl like that would cost you? And worth every drachma! Your parents would be outraged if they could hear you. I don't care! Pseudolus, I would give anything for her. You would. So, you really love this girl? Oh. I like the way you said that, huh? <laughs> now, you cannot afford to buy this girl. But in spite of that, Suppose someone, someone with tremendous cunning and guile, could arrange for her to be yours. Yes? If that someone could arrange it, what would you give me? Everything. Everything? What do you own? 20 minai, yes. a collection of seashells, and me. Right. You don't have to give me the 20 minai of the shells. If I get you that girl, just give me me. Give you, you? My freedom. Pseudolus, people don't go about freeing slaves. Be the first. Start a fashion. <laughs> give me that girl. And if I can? And you? A free. I, I'm what? Free. Free. <laughs> Writing poetry, all my voice would be free. 
Our museum will have me pickled for posterity. Can you see me? I can see you. Can you see me as a lover, one of great renown, women for free? No, but I'll buy the house of Lycus for my house in town. Can you see me? Can you see me? crushed to death on the last day of mating season. <laughs> this morning I bought my freedom. Congratulations. With this much left over for one gross indulgence. Good. I guess I am now in the market for a lifetime companion. Tell me, have you anything lying about in there? Anything to satisfy an Olympian appetite? Oh, pseudolus, friend and citizen, I have traveled the world in search of beauty, and I can say with modesty that I have the finest assortment in Rome. <laughs> Show me. Eunuch! <laughs> a fire!
have anybody in there a bit less noisy? <laughs> I have. May I present Panacea? To make her available to you, I outfit the king of Nubia. Panacea, with a face that holds a thousand promises and a body that stands behind each promise. You are disturbed. Oh, it's the proportions. Don't misunderstand me. I love the breath. It's the length. Sure, it's the right length, but is it right for me? See what I mean? Too short. Definitely not. <laughs> Too tall. Oh, like that, you look perfect together. Yeah, well, how often will we find ourselves in this position? <laughs> well, perhaps if No we... need to compromise. Consider the Gemini. A matched pair. Each a divinely assembled woman. Together, an infinite number of mathematical possibilities. you'd break up a set. Oh, I couldn't. Do you understand? Oh, completely. Fortunately, we still have... Vibrata! <laughs> Exotic as a desert bloom. Wondrous as a flamingo. Live as a tigress. For the man whose interest is in wildlife. <laughs> sight of a home, but I too wish to live past the honey night. Wait! I 
know exactly what you want. May I present Gymnasia! Gymnasia, a giant stage on which a thousand dramas can be played. success selling it to some fraternal organization. You know, a group dedicated to good works. But, on the other hand... Uh, uh, Sorelis! Yes, darling? <laughs> Do you want your freedom? More than ever. <laughs> May I see the next girl? That is the entire lot. Now, surely, <clears throat> there is one among these that can satisfy you. As of yet, I have not seen exactly what I had in mind. Courtesans, out of the sun and into the house. Into the house! 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 time to leave you in midday prayer. <laughs> Not one, just for me. Sumalis! There she is. Oh, ho, ho, ho. you fox. <clears throat> That's the entire lot. Did I not just spy a head of brown, two eyes of rich hazel, a body clad in flowing white? Oh, that one, a recent arrival from Crete. A virgin. <laughs> a virgin. A virgin. Mm. Well, only yesterday, she was sold. Sold! <laughs> why, God, why? <laughs> that? <laughs> she was sold? To the great Captain Miles Gloriosus, who comes this day to claim her. She cast 500 men I. <gasps> Five, 500? Great sum, to be sure, but being a man of conquest, his heart was set on a virgin. Uh, you say she arrived from Crete? Yes. Mm. Well, I do hope the great captain is kind to her. She deserves a little affection before, uh... Oh, tragic, is it not? Oh. <laughs> what is tragic? Oh, the news from Crete. What news? Oh, why should I darken your day? Farewell, like a... What is the news? What news? The news from Crete! Oh, I heard it. It's tragic. Doodless! <laughs> You forced me to tell you. Crete has been ravaged by a great plague. There are people dying by the thousands. But this girl is healthy. She goes smiling through the day. Oh, she doesn't. I thought you knew. When they start to smile, the end is near. <gasps> no! Yes! <laughs> I hear it is lovely now in Crete. People lying there. Smiling. <laughs> Is it contagious? Have you ever heard of a plague that wasn't? My other girls! You had best get her out of there. Yes! And then 
Well, I could look after him until the captain arrives. He could! <laughs> Would you not be... Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. I've already had the plague. I'd tell you about it, but... <laughs> oh, I do hope she lives until the captain gets here. Oh, it's soon less time to be with her. Well, until the captain's here. Yes. Wait! Yes? A brilliant idea. Yes? That is what we have to find, a brilliant idea. You must find one! Come, come, this way, my dear. Don't touch that pillar! Philia, there's someone I want you to meet. This is Sudalus. You are to stay with him until the captain comes. It won't be long. Sudalus, thank you. If none of the girls are to your liking, there soon will be new arrivals, and you shall have first choice. Uh -huh. Because, Sudalus, you are a friend. And you, Lycus, are a gentleman and a procurer. They are together. And I am to keep them together if I am to be free. What to do, what to do. I need a plan. The harbor. There I might find a way out. I am off. Wait! The captain! He may be arriving from there. Or he may be arriving from there. No, 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 no. Hero, here. You look that way. And you, oh, you, <laughs> you, you look that way. Perfect. Oh, don't worry, nothing will happen. He's a virgin, too. Stop! <laughs> you are. My name is Philia. Yes. I do not know your name, but, oh, you have beautiful legs. Uh, it's Hero. <laughs> Too, I imagine. Well, I would show them to you, but they're sold. No. Along with the rest of me, I cost 500 mid -eye. Is that a lot of money? Oh, yes. More than 300. Nearly twice as much. Oh, you see, those are the two numbers I always get mixed up. Three and four. Uh, five. Oh, I hope the captain doesn't expect me to do a lot of adding. Uh, you can't add? Oh, you see, we are taught beauty and grace and... And nothing more. I cannot add or, or spell or, or anything. I have one talent.
first thing they teach us. <laughs> oh, Philly, I love you. I love you. <laughs> where is that note? <gasps> no! No, 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 no! Miss Miriam! Uh, Cecilia? Never mind who she is. Who is she and where is she from? She's from the house of Lycus. A courtesan? <laughs> I'm a virgin. Of course. <laughs> Hero, this will never do. Never, 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 never! Now, bid farewell to the young lady and let her get back to her business. But Sudalis said. Sudalis, I might have known! Hero! Sudalis! Master! Sudalis! Get back here! Sudalis! Ow! Wow! Ow! Damn! Ow! Sudalis! Ow! Get Sudalis! Oh, yes, Hysteria. Sudalis! Ho, oh, ho, ho. Pronounced perfectly. You know, a lot of say, a lot of people say, "Oh, Sudalis, I hate it." Show the girl the garden. What? How dare you arranging an assignation between an innocent boy and a you know what, Hysterium? There is something you should know about that you know what. What? That girl about whom you think the worst is my daughter. <laughs> Your what? My daughter. <laughs> You've heard me speak of her? Never. Well, I don't like to talk about her. That girl is not your daughter! <laughs> My sister? I shall go tell his parents. Oh, wait, Miss Terry. The truth. She has been sold to a great captain who comes any moment now to claim her. Oh. I go tell his parents. Well, I go with you. Oh, you don't want to be there when I tell them about you. No, no, no. You don't want to be there when I tell them about you. Tell them what about me? I have nothing to fear. Mm. I have been a pillar of virtue. I go. <laughs> it may be of interest to the family that their slave in chief, their pillar of virtue, has secreted within the confines of his cubicle Rome's most extensive and diversified collection of erotic pottery. Subtleness! <laughs> Hero! Oh, tell me, Hysterion, wherever did you find that fruit bowl with the freeze of the guys with this? So <laughs> Hero! Oh. Uh, Hero, as you know, your mother and father placed me in charge of your innocence. However, I have decided to allow you to remain with the girl <laughs> till the arrival of her captain. Ophelia! No, oh, stop doing that! You'll hurt each other! Oh. <laughs> Master! I told you we needed a brilliant idea. Well, I've been to the harbor and I have found one. Come along. Are we going somewhere? Well, you are. You have your things. Let's fetch yours. Where are we going? Away. Where away? Far away. But my family. My captain. There's only room for two. Bench! Red, and off they sail on the first high tide, the boat in the bay. 
Dankeschön. Come, we go. Can you not? Well, as long as the captain has a contract, I have to go with him. For that is the way of a courtesan. Oh, Venus, why do you bring us together only to part us? Be brave, hero. <laughs> For us, there will never be happiness. Oh, we shall learn to live to be happy without it. Ooh. Are you saying this? Are you listening to this? <laughs> not a single word about me and my freedom. She must go with him. This standing out here is torture. Why doesn't he come and take me? Guy, in time he will take you. But on the street, inside. You will tell me when he comes. Yes, I'll have him knock on the door three times. That's two and one more. It's, it's not cute. <laughs> Correct. Three times. Now in, in, in! What is going to happen? She will go with you. Well, I am off to market. Hero, while you are alone with the girl, remember who you are. For well, I have yet to begin my daily chores. Hysteria? What? Before you go, one small favor. What? May I borrow your book of potions? Oh, no, 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 no. That stays right here, right, right where it belongs. Oh, you, bird seller, what do you have in the way of a large pea hen? Yeah, wait a minute. His book of potions and my pass to freedom. What I need is his potent sleeping potion. With a drop or two of that, the breath stops short, the eyes slam shut, and the body hangs limp. I shall mix a few drops in a beaker of wine and give it to the, the drink. I shall like us that the girl has died of the plague and tell Hero to dispose of the body. Then they have the boat, I to the hills, and you to your homes. <laughs> All right. What is this? Sanskrit? What is What's going on? Oh, it's upside down, I see. <laughs> oh, no. I have just remembered something frightening. I cannot read. <laughs> Hero, come out here. <coughs> Call these pages off to me. Uh, not now. <laughs> of course, right now. A plan depends on it. Come on. <laughs> come here. Oh, 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 oh. oh. Come here. Let's see what you're working with. Oh, how cute. Someone's a big boy. Here, call these pages off to me. Fever potion. No, hey. hold this a little lower. You're gonna scare the children. Uh, headache potion. No. Passion potion. Get the frig out of here. What are you talking about? Uh, sleeping potion. Ah, yes, that's it. The ingredients, call them off to me. What do we need? Eye of an eel. That we have. Heart of a snail. That we have. A cup of mare sweat. Mare sweat? That we have not. Why are you preparing this? I intend to give it to the girl. Asleep she'll go with you. She will? Mare sweat. Where will we find it? You'll leave that to me. You are to go to the harbor and give the boatman your 20 men eye and tell him that you sail with him on this day. I shall prepare the potion. <laughs> this is exciting! <laughs> Isn't it? Get out of here. Mare sweat. Where am I going to find mare sweat on a balmy day like this? Foolish, foolish! Oh, could have taken this to the stone cutter for me. I dropped it. Now I've got to get the nose to be sharp. Hysteria will take it for me.
Well, the thought does cross my mind. But you not must know one thing. What? Though you may have my body, you may never have my heart. Well, you can't have everything. <laughs> oh, a thousand thanks. Whichever one of you did this. <laughs> Would you believe it? There was a mass sweating not two streets from here. <laughs> Gets to look more like his father every day. Zulus! Oh, He's here! Oh, no! <laughs> Remember where we stopped. <laughs> Sir, you're back. She almost broke it. No, 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 no. I, I mean, you've returned. Well, yes. Unexpectedly. Well, apparently. Yeah. Who is she? Yeah, about. I tell the witch fitting. Yes, dear. Ever your servant. Oh, am my servant? Yes, sir. Your servant. Your new maid. We needed the help. Well, a new maid? She sure seems loyal. <laughs> she certainly is. And uh, very efficient and very courteous. And very thoughtful. Maids like me. I'm neat. I like maids. They're neat. Uh -huh. Something no household should be without.
Exertion. Is that me? Yes, sir. Oh, my heavens. I smell like an overheated horse. Well, I shall have to bathe. At least. Oh, I never should have let her into the house. I never should have listened to you. Everything will be fine, pussycat. Oh, you. You just see that she gets out of that house. And you just see that he stays in that house. Oh. Remain calm. Oh. Calm. Calm. Mustn't get excited. Stay calm. Is haunted. 
Haunted? Haunted as the day is long. Impossible. Uh, My house haunted, you say? Strange. But true. Perhaps you ought to stay with relatives. Distant relatives. Yes. No. Uh, you must fetch me a soothsayer. A please. soothsayer? Yes. Find soothsayer if I didn't. There's a spirit in my silence. <laughs> I am about to say the sooth.
son, it pains me to see a boy of your age just moping about the house. Ah, uh, suitless, I would like for you to take Hero to the back. Sir. Uh, yes, sir. Allow me first to finish your groom, Master Hero asked me to prepare. Master, I will meet you in front of the baths of Aqua Selena. You know the ones by the harbor, and I will have a surprise waiting for you. Oh, yes, yes. Uh, farewell, Sudalus. Farewell, Father. <laughs> well, he to his bed, and I to mine. Just the way you like it, sir. Oh, hysteria. Yes, sir. I shall need a complete change of garb. Uh, let's see. The tunic with the tassels. Uh, but that needs to be let out, taken in. <laughs> well, take it in and bring it out. Yes, sir. The girl. I have to know the worst. How is she? She is very low. Still smiling. Laughing. <gasps> oh. But there is one hope. I have prepared a plague potion. It is not too late. We may yet save a life. Well, give it to her. Yes. Yes. <laughs> Seek the house of Marcus Lycus. Hey, get out, boy. What are you doing? <coughs> Who seeks the house of Marcus Lycus? <laughs> Hold, sir. Who seeks the house of Marcus Lycus? <laughs> You're not holding. Here, hold this. <clears throat> who is he who seeks the house of Marcus Lycus? A foot soldier of Captain Melis Gloriosus. <laughs> Captain has dispatched you to inform you that he is but half a league away. Prepare to greet him. Half a league? We've only moments. I've got to give her the potion. Yes, yes. Wait. What? Don't leave me. Why not? He's coming. I know he's coming. The guy just said. If you speak to the captain, I will give her the potion. Wait. You can't give her the potion. Why not? You'll catch the plague. No, I don't want the plague. I've got to give her the potion. Yes. Yes. Wait. She's in the house of cynics. Oh, what do we do? Uh, uh, oh, does he know which house is your house? No. Well, then this is your house. Will he believe it? Get the girls. Good. And I'll give her the potion. And I'll get the girls. Good. Yes. Yes. Wait. What is it? <laughs> I forgot. Like this. We must not lose our heads. Yes. No. We must. I am eternally grateful. I am your friend In. until death. In! Yes! Oh. Yes! Yes! Wait! Now! Get your friggin' ass! How then? We seek the house of Marcus Lycus. Who seeks the house of Mookus Hiki? Mm. <laughs> soldiers of Captain Miles and Gloriosus. He's but a quarter of a league away and bids you honor this. Oh, thank you. Of course I do. This is writing. Your contract with the captain. And a prettier piece of work it is. Can you tell me what that word is right there? That's like it. Ah, yes. <laughs> then you know to whom you are speaking. Yes, sir. And do you see what it says there? Yes. It says words. And I intend to stand by those words, or my name is not Marcus Lycus. <laughs> or my name is not Sudalus Marcus Lycus. Here's your thing. Give me that. Uh, a moment, please. I got to speak with my eunuch. Come here, eunuch! How dare you! How dare you call me that? Look, you know it's not true, and I know it's not true. So what do you care what they think? The uh, soldiers, they've come for the girl. I shall go right in and get her. Oh, Sterium? They have not come for the girl. They have come for me. What? Mysterium, I never told you this, but many years ago, I deserted the army. No. Shh! I was very young. I wanted to be an archer, but they made me a slinger instead. Then one day, in the height of battle, I arched when I should have slung, and I had to flee. Oh, 
Pseudolus. And now they have found you. Shh. They are looking for Pseudolus. I told them I was Lycus. Then Lycus you are. Yeah, yeah. Trust me. I must. Oh, Hysterium, more bad news. I hope it's good. Oh, it's terrible. <laughs> the girl refuses to go with a captain. That is why I've prepared your sleeping potion. You are to give her a few drops in a beaker of wine, and upon hearing me say, present the bride, carry her out in your arms. Trust me, Sue. Ho! Trust me, Lycus. Yes. I, I go now, Lycus. Mm. Farewell, Lycus. Oh, my God. Bid your captain come. His bride awaits him. <laughs> Lycus, the girls, quickly! Yes, yes, oh. Unit, the girls, quickly! We shall arrange them informally. Yeah, yeah, uh, give the place a, a friendly look. Come on, let's go! Don't you lower your voice to me. I'm sorry. You are to do exactly as Sudolus bids. He will represent me. All right, now all you ladies, please, over here. And you, eunuch, come here. Give me one of these, maybe. Oh. All right, don't pop a vessel. Here we go. All right, one of these. Oh, God. Do we really need this eunuch? Into the house. OK, all right, you two, right down there is fine. You, just perfect. You, over there. And you, over here. And you, you there. Oh, there is so much of you there. Hello. <laughs> Oh. Mm. Mm. Now, may I have your attention, please? You are about to meet a great captain. Remember who you are and what you stand for. Now, would you please strike vocational attitudes? Oh, not bad, like it. Perfect. I would like a mosaic of the scene. An entire wall made up of... Uh... The captain! Look at my heart, uh, Yeah, 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 in!
it what happened. Nothing. She won't drink. What? She says on Crete her religion forbids it. Oh, of course. He had to fall in love with the religious creed. <laughs> I'll get it a drink. Forget the girl Grey Captain. She primps and preens. She wants to be worthy of so great a warrior. Understandable. I am a legend in my own time. <laughs>
If you kill me, you deprive yourself of, of seeing a, a face so fair. Oh, a heart so pure, ew, and a body so undulating. Huh? Yeah. She is magnificence personified. If you had been born a woman, you would have been she. As magnificent as that? Yes, sir. <laughs> Spare me. I'm sure she can be found. You are? Yes, sir. I'll give you a list of 10 or 20 places you could go look for her. You will look for her. Me? Would this man allow me? Where am I going with this? With that bad leg. Yes, of course. It'll do it some good. And uh, where would you like me to deliver the girl? I mean, where will you be? Waiting here, in your house. Uh, no! I mean, no! I mean, yes. Out. <laughs> <laughs> and to assure your return, men, you are to go with him. Uh, well, before I go, a word with my eunuch. Okay. <laughs> Be brief. Come here, eunuch! All right, Gustavo, this is what you must feel. Not to stray from your sight. Uh, Captain, my eunuch is making sure the house is fit to receive so illustrious a visitor. <sighs> I've been put off enough for one day. Chase scenes, right? <laughs> oh! One hour. Pretending the girl was dead was the perfect plan. Still is the perfect plan if only we could find a body. A body. Gusto! Gusto! 
Gusto, the body snatcher. He owes me a favor. Since sending my husband back to Rome, I have been haunted by the premonition that he is up to something. Whoa. Hysteria! <laughs> Hysteria! You! Mistress! You're back. What sort of potion? A uh, potion to uh, make you thirsty. And since you're already thirsty, you don't need it. Thirst is the lesser of my problems. Hysteria. I believe that my husband is fouling the nest. Oh, oh no. Never. Never? Oh, friend and confidant, you are talking to a woman. Recognize me. 
Not a word. Oh, Cyril is busy as ever. Yes, madam. She's back. Yes. What has happened? What hasn't happened? All right, what hasn't happened? She did not have to. She... No, but she will. And she'll kill me. No, she won't. No, she won't. I'll kill myself. I can do painfully. If she does, it'll hurt. <laughs> I must do it. I have been smirched the honor of my family. My father will turn in his grave. Your father is still alive. This will kill him. <laughs> Are you finished? Just about. Come here. Some really shocking news. What? You know, Gusto, the body snatcher, he died this morning. I just saw him yesterday. Yeah, that's it. Well, when is he to be buried? Oh. They don't know.
friends? Uh, why, why are you not on the phone? Uh, her captain has come. Her? Where? Uh, in there. In there? Uh -huh. No, 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 no. He's in here. What? Oh, he was called away on an unexpected ovation at the Senate. Really? Of course. <laughs> Does he still want me to wait on the roof? Yes. No. He wants you to hide in the garden. In the garden? Yes. Behind the lodge coat. You will tell me when he comes. <laughs> Don't we always? Oh, Hero. <laughs> if only you could buy me from the captain. Wait, if, if Hero has the captain's contract, you will go with him? It shall be arranged. Now into the garden. Well, uh, where's the bench? Shut up, shut up. Oh, man! Oh! Damn. Oh. 
she died. Well, she sort of just rolled over and rest. Spare me! I cannot control my tears. <laughs> I must cry. <laughs> Go ahead, sir. You'll feel better.
contract. I give her to the gods. Take her then and lay her to rest. And I shall go my melancholy way. Men! Wait! So, no, no. A farewell kiss? Uh, uh, uh. Of course!
Socrates. Okay, which one of you guys is Socrates? No, give me, give it to me, thank you. <laughs> I go now and sail the uncharted seas to the harbor. To the harbor! From which no man returns. Oh, <laughs> 